Over the last five days, I have extinct the whole population of penguins in Polaris. Welcome back to the craft box. My name is Brent and today we are getting the inspectors torment badge Which is the badge received for defeating 500 penguins on average It has taken me um, if I started at zero which I didn't because you have to defeat a few for Polaris questing It would have taken me about eight hours by myself to complete this badge Obviously it took slightly less I'd say about seven because I had a couple already done if you're with a team It can go quicker, but I thought I should also show you how to get here These are the penguins that I have been fighting the inspectors and Inspector Brigadia, or however you pronounce that last word. I don't know. But yeah, let's go back to the start of Polaris, which is where the world door is. Obviously, right here, the spiral door. Boom. And then you come down here. You you make a short left, right, sorry, over this way. And then just straight into the harbor. And as soon as you get in there, basically that's where the penguins are. So yeah, not too far away. Really, really simple to get there. And uh, I thought I should just also mention that there are a couple badges that you get previously to this 500 badge, which we are about to get in just a moment. There is one for 50, which is Inspector's Adversary. Inspector's Rival is for 100. Inspector's Nightmare is for 250. And then Inspector's Torment is for 500 penguins. And speaking of 500 penguins let's finish them off shall we we have one more to go because that's just how it worked out and i think we should probably finish it off where we start today we are using dear Knight because why not um also if you are interested in this new format or like this more new format a bit more you know let me know because this is not normally what i do for these videos i'm usually just hit but i thought i'd give you a little bit of background onto what this badge is about and how to collect it these guys are not too difficult they are what rank rank 14 storm and they generally cast pretty low damaging spells so that's not too big of an issue for most people if you're in polaris you should be fine with these guys they're not particularly hard they do not have shadow magic their power pip chance is astonishingly abysmal absolutely abysmal and they do however cast bubbles so like big or wow auras around the whole thing i can't remember what you call them global spells i guess is probably the best term to call them so be careful of that if you're gonna pop one of those up yourself as I will hopefully do later. So yeah, just be careful of that. But otherwise, they're not too difficult. They are storms, so there can be bolts that happen. But yeah, obviously they have 2,080 health after the health ner nerfs. So they're not too difficult at all. It took me about two rounds each time to kill. I would just blade and then scarecrow or Lulu or whatever I had. So yeah, if you're a death, really good. If you're going with someone else, you can probably hit first round. If you have like a fire, you could go scarecrow and, or dear knight into a... Um, meteor or something along those lines and kill so yeah, it's, it's not too bad at all There we go, and that is the badge acquired. Minus 10 backlash, love to see it. Don't take any backlash at all. There we go, Inspector's Torment. The final penguin badge is finally mine. <laughs> yes, finally. So, so fantastic. Let's, let's all look at it. Let's look at this lovely badge. We're now at 24 of 33. And there we go, Inspector's Torment. We now have a full page one and nearly a full page two. This badge will be the next badge that we go for later. In a few weeks, I would say we'll have that video up. But yeah, otherwise, I hope you enjoyed. Um, let me know how you like this new format. Remember to leave a like and subscribe. If you're already subscribed, press the wee little bell so you know exactly when I post another video. And remember to craft outside the box.